welcome back to my channel, Madame of Elegance. My twin boys are napping, and I'm going to try and film this Sephora haul for you really quickly. So first thing, I got these Sephora touch-up razors. I had never used any type of facial razor before. Um, and when I got my eyebrows micro-shaded a few weeks ago, um, she had actually used razors to kind of touch up the eyebrow, to kind of shape it. And I really liked how clean everything looked when she used the razor. Normally, I just kind of tweeze the stray hairs and shape it into place. This is the second item. Estee Lauder Double Wear Foundation supposed to stay in place for 24 hours now that I'm a mom and I'm not getting enough sleep during the night my under eye dark circles have gotten really bad and i um, looking for something with more coverage because apparently this is one of those Eller award top recommendation foundations and with that I also got the um, matching concealer as well Concealer, the color I got was 1C Light, cool, and then foundation was in Ivory Nude. And then the item that I've been looking most forward to is this. The Amica Jack of All Curls um, Curling Iron. This is the curling iron that I've been using religiously for the past 10-15 years it was just a cheap Conair curling iron metal barrel so it's not really good for your hair and I finally got an expensive curling iron set because the boys ended up breaking this cheap linen curling iron I've been using so this is broken the control setting is now off of the iron. I mean it still works but now that I can't control the heat settings it doesn't really do me any good and I've been looking for an excuse to order a higher quality curling iron anyway so this is going into the garbage. I also decided to splurge on this fancier curling iron because I found that after I got pregnant, my hair seemed to change a bit. My hair is quite fine and it is on the thinner side. And after I got pregnant, it is a little more stubborn and it doesn't hold curl as well as it used to. So every time I curled my hair using the metal curling iron, the at the end of the day, it almost fell flat. I ordered this curling iron because it does have higher temperature settings. I'm hoping that will help kind of maintain the curl a bit more for my hair. This is the box. Amica Jack of All Curls and these are the different sized barrels. It's interchangeable. Just open that up and it comes in this really nice case. it's kind of it's hard and it's a zippered here I'm gonna pop this open and this is what it looks like inside so the barrels and the um, electronic piece. The set also comes with a, I guess, heat protecting glove for your free hand that's not going to be controlling the curling iron. Not sure why it only has two fingers and a thumb. Not sure how that's gonna work, but I'm going to give it a try. I might, in the end, not end up using this on a daily basis if I have good control over the iron because with my old iron it does have that clamp this one it's just the wand you will have to wrap your hair around the wand and then 
let it uh, curl and then um, release. While the boys are still napping, I'm going to go ahead and try to curl my hair and see what this is going to be like. I just have it hooked up here. It's got this um, lock and unlock so you can switch out the barrel, temperature settings, plus minus, and on off button, and then the digital reading here of the temperature. And it does have this little stand to keep it from touching the um, counter. I already can smell it heating up here. So I'm going to go ahead and start curling my hair and let you know what I think for my first thoughts. fingered glove does come quite handy because the wand does heat up quite fast and it does get really hot. I actually had to turn down the temperature so it heated up to 450 I turned it down to 360. Result. Again, this is the first time I've used the curling iron. First thoughts, I really like the curling iron. It heats up fast, it's stylish, and it's rose gold pink, so really girly. I might, as I use it in the next few days, find a temperature I like better, but this was at 360 if I remember correctly. It's still going to take me some time to get used to using a curling iron without the clamp, but I'm really liking the results so far. My hair seems to be um, more voluminous with this curling iron. I might play around with the size of the barrels as well because this one was a tiny bit smaller than the one I had been using. I really like it. Just, um, like I said, I think it's going to take me some time to get used to using this curling iron instead. But my hair feels really soft. Hopefully the curl kind of holds up more towards the end of the day. But I think it already is, even with me kind of like playing around with it. <laughs> fun for you to watch please remember to like the video if you enjoyed it and subscribe to see what is new with me and the twins because we do vlog a lot I'm trying to post a lot more um, videos that are kind of to my interests as well so yeah please <laughs> be my friend